We will discuss all these topics in this video. Please. A nice app to control anything online. First of all go to Play Store and search Blink. Download the app, then after open the app. There are many options to log in. If you are new, make account first. We have already have an account so we will sign in. Remember, we will need to turn on the mobile phone hotspot during the entire process. Click on the login button after filling the info. We have successfully logged in. Now we will need to create a project. So click on the plus button here. Write the name of project as per your choice. Then after select the device you are using from the list here. Then click on the create button below. Blink automatically sends the token to our registered email to use it in the programming of the device. Now we have to add the required buttons as per the project. So we will add 5 buttons to on off the appliances and one slider to change the speed of fan. You can see complete setting on the screen. Please leave a helpful comment for us in the comment section below. Select the pins of ES page 32 used for relay operation, as shown on the screen. Write the name of button, same as the name of equipment for easy understanding. We can move the widgets anywhere, as per our requirement. We have completed all the widget setting, and our final setup looks like this. We have one mobile phone with charger, for socket 1, so let's connect it to the socket. For socket 2, we will use a power bank with charger as shown on the screen.
Our system requires 230 volt AC for the operation. Our final test setup looks like this, so let us test it, and see the performance. The app is not connected to the system as showing here because, the system is off now. Let us turn on the system, using the main switch. Name of the project is appearing on the LCD screen. Please keep these terms in mind, before the operation. There is no red mark showing on the screen, it means it is connected to the system. Let us turn on lamp 1. One means, on, and zero means, off. Lamp 1 has successfully turned on. Let us turn on lamp 2. Same for others, as showing. Now we will turn on socket 1 and socket 2 as showing. Power bank charging is started. Now we will turn on socket 2. It is working very fine, as we can see. If you think it is helpful for you, please like this video. Let us see the performance of fan speed controller. F indicates the current speed of fan here. We are using a lamp instead of fan, but we can use a fan on the same place. You can see the difference of speed in the intensity of lamp. Please look with concentration. Please make sure to leave a comment. It help us to motivate for future videos. Also share the video.